All right, everybody. Hey, uh, I'm Lieutenant Patrick Garrett McCurry. This is my wife. Hey, I'm Nicolette. And uh, we are current residents here at NAS Jacksonville. And that's Ella. Ella. Those are all Ella. <laughs> two kids. Um, we have a, a wonderful uh, home here. Uh, three bedrooms, two baths. Um, that our kids really enjoy it. Uh, we're right next to a beautiful playground, uh, which we frequent very often. Um, lovely cul-de-sac here. Uh, we have we built great relationships with our neighbors. Um, so this is a uh, senior enlisted to junior officer housing. Um, we've really enjoyed our time here. Very convenient to get to work, uh, which is fantastic. So we're just going to invite you in and take a little tour of our home. So this is our entryway. Um, it leads directly into um, a laundry room. We use like a office bonus room, and then we have the kitchen and the living room. We have. Um, like a dining room area that seats pretty comfortably for, I mean, you can see at least six, but for right now we only need four. Um, and then we have kind of like an open concept. So it leads into the living room um, where we have a fireplace, lots of shelving to store stuff. Um, also, it makes it uh, really nice because we have so much window space and so much light coming in, especially with the tree. So it really does. Over here, we have the kitchen. It's just like your typical galley style kitchen, but it's actually pretty wide. So, I mean, me and him can definitely fit comfortably, both of us cooking. Um, so it comes with a stove. Uh, we did bring our own microwave, but then like a dishwasher and a kitchen or uh, refrigerator with a freezer. And then we have pantry space right here. You probably don't want to look in the pantry space. It's not bad. It's really not. Um, but then there is lots of storage. So there's lots of counter space to cook with. Uh, we never really have problems finding places to cook with. Three bedrooms right off the hallway and then a bathroom right across. I'll kind of show you how we have our house laid out, but you could definitely do something different. So this was our oldest daughter's room. When we moved in, we only had one kid. So this was kind of like her all space. Um, now it's kind of a playroom because she wants to sleep with her little sister. Um, so we still have like the rocker set up. She has a house to play with, her Barbie house. And then we keep all of the girls' clothes in here. So if you want to come in and look, you can kind of look. We have it kind of set up where you actually have shelves on either side. Um, but we have one of the girls' clothes on one side and then one of the girls' clothes on the other side. And then there's plenty of space above and below to actually Mine. put Quinn oh. plenty of stuff to actually put storage above and below. Um, so I, right across the hall is the bathroom. This is going to sound really weird, but this is probably my favorite room in the house because <laughs> the bathroom is massive. So, um, I mean, it would be nice to have a double vanity, but we definitely only need one. There's plenty of counter space here. And then the bathroom and tub we don't even really use the other bathroom and then if you want to peek in here we actually have a massive storage closet like a linen closet so, yeah. so we didn't take the master we took the biggest bedroom because it makes more sense um so this is our bedroom please ignore my pregnancy pillow um and then i keep all of my clothes in here because i'm a girl and i have more clothes so, <laughs> all, all the bedrooms are great size. They're yeah, really they are. Size. So great we, size. We use this bathroom as kind of like our master to give <laughs> when guests come. We use that as more like a guest bathroom. Yeah. And we'll... This right now is our nursery slash guest bedroom slash she's now sleeping in here. <laughs> and then it makes it really nice for when guests come because they actually yeah. have their own bathroom. It's a little bit smaller, but for, you know, two standard adults, like, it's per it makes perfect sense. This is where you actually have a shower in here. We just very rarely use it because we like the bigger one. But, yeah. And then my closet's behind you, so I got to keep all my stuff <laughs> in there. Uh, and that's where Jimmy and Papa live. I mean, great, great size closet. That's where Jimmy and Papa live. Yeah. Yeah. Right off of the doorway is this kind of like bonus room. It's not really counted as a bedroom, but you could definitely use it as a bedroom if you wanted to. We use it as office space slash 
having the rest of our kids' toys, especially if they want to take it outside because you can get in and out really quickly. Um, we were worked out really well for us because we were both in school while we were here, so we definitely needed a separate space. And then lastly is the laundry room. It's probably the biggest laundry room I've ever seen. Um, there's You can't really complain about having extra storage space. So there's um, storage space on the walls. They're above the washing machine and dryer. They're below. Um, and then there's plenty of space that you can fold up if you want to. And then this leads directly into the garage. So you could kind of make it like a mud room slash laundry room. Good, uh, good uh, overhead patio, you know, just to keep the sun off, which is great. And uh, we have a lot of wood, which provides lots of shade, which is fantastic. And then right here is an enclosed uh, storage area with just tons of room for um, anything that, you know, anything that's not your day-to-day -day items or just, just it literally goes all the way through storage. So uh, it's nice to have something that's ventilated and closed off so that you can store whatever without it getting damaged. Thank y'all so much for coming and touring our house. Uh, we just wanted to give you kind of a little example of what it's like to live in the River Oaks neighborhood. I know it really helped us when we first moved in. Um, it's a great, great community and we really hope you join us. So I'll see y'all later. Bye.